hello everyone welcome to a new vlog today is actually my birthday big old 2-8 today um and i am just about to head out ellie is here she's currently in the toilet and we are having a fun day together she's taking me to the f1 arcade i think it's called um for those of you who don't know i love f1 here she comes she's coming there she is. <laughs> um, she's taking me to the F1 arcade, which I'm very excited about, actually. Um, so... We are racing. We're racing. <laughs> Ellie put in my card, we're going racing. I thought, oh, what? <laughs> um, but yeah, that's where we're heading. Um, it's kind of weird, it doesn't feel like my birthday. I know, you know it's what? a weekday. Also, when you're younger, you get like, you wake up and there's presents waiting for you downstairs. It's yeah. not quite the same when you're on your own. Yeah, completely. So, but I got here quite early. You did get here quite early. Drink. Yeah, like, Ellie came here early. <laughs> it feels like it should be like 2 p.m. or something. It does, because we've had croissants, we've had breakfast, like we've been chilling for hours. <laughs> um, but yeah, so we're heading out and I'm gonna have lunch. And then I'm who knows excited. where the day takes us. I expect you to be good considering how much Formula One you've watched. But yeah, but I'm not good <laughs> dri <laughs> driving is a whole different ball game. I'm really interested to see how it feels like. It's apparently supposed to feel like you're in a Formula oh, One. Oh, I'm excited. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, we're gonna head off. Maybe go get a coffee. Well, yes. hot chocolate with me. And it's gonna yeah. be a good day. I'll take you along with me. A day off with a treat from Ellie, a Costa coffee. Yeah, truly. Hot chocolate, of course, I was and a Molina. Not coffee. <laughs> <laughs> this is a coffee. <laughs> Hot chocolate and a Molina shortbread. Very excited. We've arrived. Let's go. day because it's now the evening and i got home hours ago um but i just chilled on the sofa and like relaxed because i was actually quite tired and i had a few glasses of champagne so you know when you're like a little bit tipsy and you feel a little bit tired um yeah so we went to the f1 arcade which i highly recommend if you're anyone who likes f1 or you know anyone who likes f1 they'll love it it was so much fun it was kind of like i didn't really know what i was doing um but any boy would love it there was literally businessmen in there you know what if that's what you fancy doing then um so yeah did that and then we went for lunch uh at madison which was really nice um had a couple of glasses of champagne i think i had three glasses of champagne altogether which you should do on your birthday right so i had that um and came home to some flowers for my manager which i'll show you in a second and yeah it was just a really lovely day and i'm having a really lovely week so i'm going to share some of the things that i'm up to this week with you guys um obviously not every single thing i do but bits and bobs um because my friend meg's coming to stay on friday so we're doing some fun things so i'll share that share that share, can't speak share that with you um on friday um but yeah i'm just gonna have a nice chilled evening i got this new hoodie in from live fast die young which i will show you properly tomorrow because i've got some other bits that they sent me so i'll show you those as well um but yeah that is uh over and out for actual birthday day technically i don't turn 28 until nine o'clock and it's currently one minute it's seven o'clock so i technically am not 28 yet but um yeah feeling good feeling good who doesn't want to feel good on their birthday do you know what i mean i'm um, really hot because i was just dancing to a uh, bit of mcfly <laughs> but yeah anyway i'm gonna go i'm gonna love you leave you i'll see you tomorrow 
for day two of birthday fun, even though I have nothing planned tomorrow, so. <laughs> Good morning, it's now Thursday. Um, I didn't vlog anything yesterday because I actually feel like I had the birthday blues. I don't know if that's a thing, but I, I feel like I did. I had such a nice birthday um, and I had such a lovely evening and just chilled. And then yesterday was like, oh, back to work. And because I've got other plans this week, I feel like yesterday was just one of those days where I was like, nothing was going on, nothing was happening, I just had to work. And I was a bit like, no, nah, not today. Um, but today I'm actually about to head out to go meet someone for a meeting. And then um, I'm going to meet my sister and her boyfriend later. Probably won't film anything of that because um, I never do when I'm with family. Um, and then tomorrow Meg's coming. So there'll be lots more of a vlog second half of this vlog will be when i'm with meg because um obviously i'll vlog when i'm with her um we've got some fun things coming up coming up doing things we're doing fun things we're together so you'll get to see that so sorry the middle of this vlog is a bit like crap but good things coming um but anyway i'm just about to get dressed because i need to head out soon um and i also need to plan some outfits uh for shooting this weekend when I'm with Meg but I don't really have time to do that today well do that now go for my meeting come back and I'll do it when I come back I don't know why I'm telling you this I have no idea um but yeah anyway I'm gonna get ready I'll show you my outfit before I head out um I'm thinking something cool casual I don't know how cold it is so yeah right it's taken me about an age to choose an outfit because I am trying to save certain trousers and jeans for the weekend so <laughs> I was like panicking because you know when you have those like, go to outfits to wear uh, um yeah so I started to dress out but this is what we've gone with um jeans are Uniqlo I've just turned them up featured these in my recent Uniqlo haul they're so nice look at them oh I love them um got my gazelles on just to add a bit of colour because I feel like we're in spring we should have a bit of colour and I quite like gazelles with this colour denim I think it looks really cool then I've got on my Picanti jumper um I just needed a bit of cream so got that on and then I've just popped on this H&M bomber jacket just to add obviously a bit of warmth but I didn't know I don't know whether I'm going to stick with this or not I've got literally like five ten minutes before I need to leave so I don't really have much choice in this matter um but yeah this is the vibe this is what we're going for I'm gonna head out I've got to go I'll speak to you soon. Just take my hand. You, you, as a young and bright. Keep that in a day. I'm more than me. Yeah, I'm ready. One step. I have just done my hair. I use the Dyson Air app, which I bought myself for my birthday um, because I thought, why well, not treat myself? And I've been wanting a Dyson Air app for ages. So, anyway, I used it this morning and then put some rollers in my hair. I don't know how long it's going to last. I don't really know like the best ways to use a Dyson Air app because, like, I've literally just got it and I've not researched it at all. Um, I just get too excited. But I'm loving the kind of flicky blowout look that it gives. Um, I have, like, this blow-dry brush um, device from Babyliss, which I've been using. But this is so much easier to use in terms of, like, getting the hair and getting it all look smooth and whatnot. So I'm, I'm loving how it's looking so far. Um, I've just got ready, I say ready. I'm pretty sure I'm in the same outfit I was wearing yesterday. I'm not sure. Um, I haven't done my lipstick, I haven't put jewelry on, I haven't got dressed yet. Um, this is just like a comfy outfit. But I currently just need to tidy up my flat because Meg's coming today. And uh, yeah, my flat's a little bit messy. So before I head out to go meet her, I need to tidy my flat, put my washing away so that when she comes in it's not a tip. Um, and yeah, I'm really looking forward to seeing her. We're having a nice little day out today. Um, and she's staying at mine for a couple of nights, which will be really nice. So yeah, very much looking forward to the weekend. Um, but anyway, I'm going to put you on a time lapse while I sort this stuff out because it's 
these beautiful flowers that my management sent me for my birthday how pretty i love these like lilac-y pinky colors these are so pretty i don't know what they are but they're really pretty like look oh they're so pretty um the vase is from h&m by the way h&m home love it my flat is looking so pretty at the moment like it's just so spring vibes these are my faux tulips from amazon i'll link them below just pop them in this um little jug which is from primark home um just to add a little bit of spice but everything's looking so pretty i'm loving it i am ready so i thought i'd share with you guys my outfit today i actually featured this on instagram already um i did a reel and now i want to go and shoot pictures of it because i feel like it deserves a picture um so today's the day and it's kind of sunny out I don't know if I've got enough layers on, but we roll with it. Do you know what I mean? Um, so, I'm wearing this uh, roll neck, like, long sleeve top from Uniqlo. I have also got a vest on underneath just to add a bit of extra warmth because it's kind of thin, this top. And I'm like, is it enough? I have got another long sleeve top in my bag just there um, to put underneath it if it is cold. But I should hopefully be fine. Um, and then I've got on my leather jacket this is from i bought it from princess polly no i didn't i got sent it from princess polly i've had it for years uh, but i believe it's by the brand lioness um really lovely jacket i will link it below for you guys um i'm just gonna do it up and like do up the belt as well so it like has quite a cool put together like structured done up look that's the kind of vibe we're going for um and then i've got on my pandora necklaces these are both from the pandora me collection and i love them like i've been wearing them a lot and i don't know if you can see but there's little charms here i've got a little smiley face and a little heart um so yeah they're from pandora i love them i wear them all the time and then my earrings are from anine bing they're just like a cool chunky like long hoop i felt like this outfit needed like a really big chunky hoop rather than just like a simple one um so that's the top half i also got my pandora bracelets and rings on um and then my trousers are from uniqlo i love these they fit so nicely they're really comfortable they're a really good pair of black trousers actually like you could dress them up dress them down i've clearly worn them more casually here but you could dress them like up and wear them for work which i think is great and then i've also got on my adidas specials specials i don't know how you say that um, with some black socks because I just felt like black socks works the best with this kind of outfit. Um, I wore these the other day and they're really comfortable so we're blurry. Um, so yeah, that is my outfit and then I'm probably going to do my coach bag, my coach demi bag with this. Um, if I manage to get a photo in it. But I thought I'd wear it today because it's one of those outfits that needs to be worn. You know when you put an outfit together and you're like, okay this outfit has got to be taken out of my bedroom and outside. It's being taken outside today so yeah anyway i have got to get myself ready and together to go and meet meg um i also have another outfit in my asos bag just over there um which is something i need to shoot so i'm going to try and do that today um if not do it tomorrow but yeah that is my outfit i'm going to head off and go meet meg hello um i'm such a rubbish vlogger and i do apologize I am not a natural vlogger, it has to be said. Um, it's something I'm teaching myself to do. I'm going to do more of it, I promise. But this vlog did not go how I thought it was going to go. Um, basically, as soon as me and Meg started hanging out and chatting, we I just lost all thought of even picking up my camera. Um, I always do this when I'm with people that I love spending time with. Like I so highly value the time that I spend with friends, family, loved ones. It's so important to me and I really, really value it. So I often don't tend to go on my phone. 
on like pick up my camera it's just something i don't tend to do that much um i do it on social media as well like i won't i don't intentionally not share things i just enjoy the time with my friends family i enjoy like being with them and being in the moment so i didn't really vlog much past the time you've just seen um and i just realized that i didn't vlog anything so i thought i'd make it somewhat better and share with you guys some bits that i recently picked up i have got some more bits and bobs to share with you but i might add that into a different video but I just have a few new bits that I'm really enjoying at the moment and one of the parcels that came today was this H&M parcel. Um, so I thought I'd show you what's inside this, which I think you guys will actually really like. If you like pyjamas, if you like aesthetic things, if you like my whole interior vibe, very Scandi vibes, very cute, you'll like these pyjamas. Also, I apologise about the lighting. It's for some reason decided that it wants to be sunny and then not sunny. Um, so I saw these pajamas, I actually shared these on my Instagram and I literally bought them straight away and I'm so glad I did, I think they're so cute. So first up we have these which are stripy pajamas with little lemons on, it's so cute, they're like cotton pajamas, these are like short sleeve which is great for summer, I have some pajamas like this from H&M which are long sleeve and I love them, they're so comfortable to wear and I think as it warms up I'll be able to actually wear pyjamas on their own without having to wear a dressing gown all the time but I just thought they were so cute so this is a little shirt top and then you get shorts to go with, like how sweet! Um, I just absolutely love pyjamas like this, you can just wear them around the house when it's, sun when it's sunny and nice and warm and it's not freezing out, oh I can't wait, I love them so much that I also got them in this pink style. This pink style have strawberries on them. I actually saw these ones first. Um, look, pink with strawberries on. So flipping cute. Like, can you deal? Can you deal? Can you cope? Adorable. And then they also come with little shorts. So shorts don't have pockets, which is the only downside. But these pajamas are so cute and I can't wait for it to warm up so I can wear them. I'll link both below. Um, I got them both in an extra small and they fit really nicely. The shorts are a tad long, but I can like roll them up, which is good. So I got those from H&M. I've not really seen much else on H&M actually recently that I've liked, but those pajamas just like have my heart. Um, this next item is a pretty spenny one. This was kind of like a birthday gift to myself. I mentioned earlier that I got the Dyson Air Up. Still learning, teaching myself on that one. Um, and my mum said she put some money towards it. So that was nice of her as like a gift. Um, but this was a piece that I, basically I saw it on someone on TikTok and I fell in love with it. The minute I saw it, I was like, I want that. And then I ummed and ahed about it and then it went out of stock and then I found it in stock. And you know when you think about something constantly, I thought about it constantly. This is from Acne Studios. I've never really owned a designer piece of clothing. Um, not to the extent that's like, you know, it's expensive and I'm like, whoa. Um, this was 460, I think, something like that, which is not cheap, but this skirt is stunning. Like I'm obsessed with this skirt. I can't even express to you how much I love this. Um, so it's a like, Satiny, yeah, I would say it's like a satin material and it's all crinkled. You can't really see because the sun's come out. Why? Um, but it's like, oh, hang on, wait for the sun to go. Sun, not now. Okay, that's a bit better. Um, so it's like a crinkled, like, wrap look skirt with a little bit of lace. You can't really see it right now. I'll try and pop a picture slash a clip of it on screen but I'm not promising anything because I have no internet right now. So God knows when I'll manage that, but I will post it on my Instagram, TikTok very, very soon. So make sure you look out for that. But it's basically like a really cool, like drapey midi skirt. Um, I just love it. I'm so sorry about the lighting. It's actually infuriating me. Um, it's beautiful. It's a beautiful, beautiful skirt. And it's got like a wrap tie that goes around the waist. I love it. I will share a picture slash, you can see it on my Instagram slash, um, I'll link it below so you can check it out. But it's a beautiful skirt. Wasn't cheap, like I said, it was 400 pounds, but I love it, I can, I'm obsessed with it. Talking of skirts, I also bought another skirt. Now it decides to be dark, um, from Topshop, which is like 
it's not the same it's completely different but it's also similar do you know what i mean um this is a satin midi well actually i think it's called a maxi skirt um oh my god it's dirty sake i always do this whenever i shoot content something ends up dirty so i need to wash this now um but it's a maxi like champagne colored skirt and i love it i love a satin skirt i love a top shop satin skirt in particular i've posted a little video on my instagram wearing this um it's like a little coffee shop if you're looking for it with this jumper actually um and i love it i love the way it looks i think it's such a gorgeous skirt i am gonna now go and wash it did not realize i got it dirty but yeah, beautiful, beautiful skirt. I'll link it below. It's quite long. I'm five foot four, five foot three, five foot four. I don't really know. And it hits me around my ankles like it's a full length skirt. So if you're any taller, obviously it will hit shorter. If you're any long, if you're any shorter, no. Yeah, if you're any shorter, it'll be longer. Um, but yeah, I love it. It's so nice. And I got it in a size four. Such a lovely skirt. And I'm loving Topshop at the moment. So much so, I bought something else from Topshop. I got this... Um, satin i have a thing for satin but i have a thing for like silky satin in this color this like off-white cream color oh my god butt fingers um and whenever i see like really lovely pieces in this kind of color i instantly buy them because i think they look so expensive and you can get like expensive dresses and stuff like that in this shade that look pretty much the same so anytime i find like satin pieces in this color I buy them and this is like a satin shirt I just think it's beautiful I don't think it's showing up too well on camera but it is stunning um and I love it it's kind of more oversized I've got this in a six and it fits like oversized which I love um I just think it's stunning and I just can't wait to wear it like when it warms up like with some like denim shorts or something like that I just think it's beautiful um and then the last thing I have to show you oh, I was dropping everything on the floor is this top from and other stories i really liked it because it's like a slinky material and it's really soft and i thought for this time of year where it's like still a bit cold but it's kind of a bit warm this is a really good piece and it's like got that like drapey material really comfortable definitely one that i could wear like going into summer because it's not always going to be warm especially here in the uk so yeah and it's got like more of a higher neck i don't know how much this was uh 55 pounds but yeah i love it i think it's so nice and i love this like blue color i think it's a little bit different i don't tend to wear blue I tend to wear like more like either white cream black so it's nice to have a bit of color um but yeah those are all the pieces that i've picked up recently oh my god look at this my friend jamie bought me this gorge little vase look at that oh <gasps> adorable i think it's from oliver bonus i could be wrong yeah it's from oliver bonus it's adorable. it's adorable also another thing that i love these tulips oh does not just scream spring tulips are my favorite flower in case you want this to know um and i just love them i went into sainsbury's yesterday and just bought loads of tulips there's some more over there i just think they bring all the good vibes also those flowers that i showed you um from my manager that i got on my birthday which was what day is it today over a week ago now still going strong beautiful love so yeah that is the end of the vlog i hope you enjoyed this i will be doing more vlogs soon i promise i'm just trying to get myself into the mode of them mode of them routine of them um because i'm just so out of whack at the moment uh with everything just and i have no internet right now and i can't express to you how annoying having no internet is i actually had to complain to ee about the fact they hadn't updated me that it was still broken and they hadn't updated me that they couldn't fix it so um yeah i'm just praying to the gods that it comes back soon because it's the most frustrating thing it's actually like thrown me out out thrown me off completely because i went from like a life where internet is kind of always there i can like you know maybe have a little look online or watch stuff during the day and stuff like that to like having nothing and i don't what i work in a way of having those things and then not having it oh my god it's messed with my brain so i've had to really like get myself into a new routine without internet and when i do upload this video whenever that may be 
I'll upload it, but who knows when you'll see this, I don't know. But um, when you do, I hope you enjoy it. And I'll link everything I've featured in this video along with anything I'm wearing um, and all that down below. And I'll also link the F1 Arcade that I went to. Highly recommend it, it was so good. Um, definitely one for any boyfriends, people that love F1, it was really fun. Anyway, yeah, hope you enjoyed this video guys and I will see you all in my next one. Bye!